Hello, I'm Amy, a master's dietetic student at UConn. Today I'll be talking about beans, which are plant-based proteins. This doesn't mean green beans, but instead talking about the beans that grow in the ground called legumes. Beans have lots of fiber and protein. You can add to soup, stews, chilies, tacos, and salads. There are many kinds. A few examples are kidney, garbanzo, navy, and lentils. Buying beans are convenient and cost less than fresh meat, poultry, and seafood. You can buy beans canned or dry. For dry beans, I have an example of red kidney beans. And the quick soak method, you rinse the dried beans under running water using a colander, put the beans in a pot on the stove covered with water, bring to a boil, turn off the heat and let them soak for about an hour. In note, split peas and lentils don't need soaking because they are much smaller and flatter than a kidney bean or garbanzo bean. For the canned beans, I have an example of red kidney beans and also garbanzo beans. These canned beans are convenient as they are fully cooked and are ready to add to meals. Look for options that say no added salt or low sodium. And you can remove some of the sodium by rinsing and draining the beans, which I'm going to demonstrate. So you can open the can. You can get a colander and pour them in. And then turn on the water and you can rinse the beans. And then shake it a bit to drain. And you're gonna remove some of the sodium. And there are some other plant-based proteins that I wanna mention, including peanut butter, nuts, and seeds that are all high in protein and are healthy fats. Fall in love with eating beans and other plant-based proteins. Thank you.